Welcome to the channel of the Roving Vets. I'm Bethany. I'm Rob. And don't forget about our road dog, Maverick. We bought our first camper in August of 2020 and moved in in October of 2020 and have been full-time RVing America ever since. We are also both Army veterans, which is why we picked the name The Roving Vets. While Rob is dumping the tanks today, I'm going to the Desert Bar with Q24. It is a completely off-grid bar and grill in the middle of the desert. Pretty cool concept. Let's go. All right, so today we are going to go to the Desert Bar. Right, right. I'm not sure where it's okay. at. Up above Parker, right around Parker, Arizona. Melinda's yeah. got it pulled up for us. And yes. we, we left the men at home. Uh, we love it. It's Girls Day Out. Girls, girls Day, Day Out. out. Alright, so we have made it to the Desert Bar. We got a couple other YouTubers here. Oh Come on God. over here. Hello. Tell everybody who you are. Oh, I'm Dang. Nice to meet you, everyone. Dang and, and Bob. Bob from Bob, Bob and Dang's, Dang's Journey. Journey. There you That's go. Funny. Also over here, we got Miss Tennessee. Yep, yep. Simple Life Big Adventures. Yeah. As it opens so a lot of people here already today I'm not sure how busy this place is supposed to get but we have heard that is is a staple and you have to come here if you are gonna be in the area it's about an hour drive from Quartzsite but uh, beautiful drive it's a uh, in in Parker the address is Parker it's the middle of the desert complete solar panels completely off-grid bar you have to have cash so really cool concept if you ask me I guess I might should add, um, Rob was complaining about having to go. He didn't want to go. So, and who's this guy right here? We got Robert from Mord Life Outdoors. Mord Life Outdoors. Right Howdy, everyone. Hey. Um, we've been hanging out with him a lot this week. But uh, Rob decided he didn't really want to come today. We needed generator fuel because the battery is officially at, like, I think it was 14% when we woke up this morning. And he didn't want to go anyway, so now he gets to instead take the camper into Quartzsite from the BLM land, get some fuel. He's also gonna just go ahead and fill up the tanks and dump the tanks while he's at it. And I was like, hey, if you don't wanna go work today, I'll go work today on YouTube and you can do the camper fun. So I came here with little Miss Tennessee Melinda and uh, we're gonna have a blast out here at the Desert Bar. So this place has a pub and grill, so you can come up here and get you some food while you're here too. 40 years, man, y'all. Alright, so I got me some regular fries with some beer cheese. Melinda got her some bacon jalapeno pepper jack burger with regular fries. fries. And ketchup. Oh, garlic fries all the way. We got garlic fries and ribs. And ribs, there we go. Yeah. About to eat some food. I'm the only weird one that eats mustard with my fries. Because um, that's a lot of ketchup and not a lot of mustard. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hi. <laughs> All Okay, so we got here like right when it was opening because it don't open till noon. Look at this though. There's a whole, 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 whole lot more people out here now. Definitely a lot more off-roaders. I mean, I guess I say it off-roaders. My Jeep definitely off-roads. All right, so it's a little chillier out here than I thought it was gonna be today. So took the purple one off. We're gonna go with the flannel shirt instead because that sun shirt, which is exactly what that was, was a sun shirt. A little too chilly for out here today, so we're just gonna go with the flannel.
here is your view from your ladies' restroom. Here we go. Arizona. It has a Parker, Arizona, Arizona address, zero cell phone service, and it only takes an, they only take cash. All right, y'all, it's officially exit time, and we are leaving the desert bar with one extra. Somebody else that was staying at our camp, um, well, didn't want to leave yet, and somebody else that they wrote, he rode with, Tom rode with somebody else, and now he's riding back with us, so here we go. So as I stated at the beginning of this, the Desert Bar is a completely off-grid bar and grill in the middle of the desert and you need or want to at least have a four-wheel drive to get out there. It's definitely kind of like a washboard in some areas, but if you can make it out there, it's totally worth it. An incredible view, lots of live music. There was live music the whole time we were there. The food was great. Uh, I didn't have anything to drink except water, but I completely thoroughly enjoyed my time. Melinda and I rode together from our camp area, which we went with Q24, which is a group of YouTubers and people who watch YouTube that we met out in Quartzsite that we actually came to Quartzsite to meet with. We drove here about an hour from Quartzsite to get to this location, and would I go back? I sure would. Rob didn't go, and I'm trying to convince him to go back already. So if you're in the area and want to try to make it, and you have a vehicle you think is capable, absolutely try it. You won't regret it. Anyway, I'm going to let you finish this up. Until next time. What time is it? I'm too sleepy. I'm sorry, but... That is so bright. Why are LED lights so freaking bright? <laughs> Who put those in here? You hear the beeping? Mm -mm. Oh, yeah. Listen. I don't hear nothing. You better go check. You know what they always say? Go check on the propane always goes out and out. You know what they say? Best thing he has to go change the propane over. You know what they say? The propane's the boy job. <laughs> I, I want to turn my wiener inside out. <laughs>